how is Germany the richest country in Europe? I actually didn't know Germany was the richest country in Europe. So yeah, really excited to jump in this and see what we got. At the time of making this video, Germany's GDP is estimated to be around 4.2 trillion US dollars. What? Wait, this what's the UK's? Of money is hard to comprehend. However, it is still less than the combined market cap of the two most valuable brands on the planet. Okay. Apple and Saudi. Mad. Apple, whose total market cap is valued at 5 trillion US dollars. <laughs> An economy size of 4.2 trillion makes Germany the fourth richest country in the world. Yo, wait, I didn't know this, bro. So US is first, 22 trillion. China, 16. Japan, five. Germany, four. United Kingdom, three. What? When looking at this metric. Of course, this does not reflect individual. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. America's is stupid high, bro. 23 trillion. <laughs> Your wealth, but the wealth of the value of all finished goods and services made within Germany during a specific period. Right. Only Japan, China, and the USA have a larger economy. Each have a population That's crazy. of 1.5, 16.6, and four times larger, respectively. So just how is mad Germany the richest country in Europe? Well, yo, yeah. After everything Germany went through, right, the previous hundred years. That's actually mind blowing that they're number four on the richest list. Like they they've put in some serious work, bro. Some serious work. Germany is an economic powerhouse. It sits in the middle of Europe. Right. It's a founding member of the EU and is the second most populated country on the continent. Eighty three million Russia. Which kind of cheats by sitting in two continents. <laughs> Only the Dutch work fewer hours among the 34 members of the OECD, right. which contains 38 countries from around the world. That German children spend 25% less time in the classroom than their Italian counterparts. Oh, wow. And that there are six more productive economies in Europe alone. Okay. And Germany still has the strongest economy in Europe. So first things first, let's take a look at how Germany compares to other European countries in Actually terms of this. GDP. So the UK sits just below them with 3.1 trillion. We'll take Next it. Is France at 2.9 trillion, Italy at 2.1 trillion, and then Russia at 1.6 trillion US dollars. Yo, other than the UK, they're pretty much double. Ah, they're not double France. But that's mad, bro. However, it must be noted that due to the sanctions from Russia's invasion of Ukraine, it is likely that Russia's economy size is actually much lower than this figure. So right. Germany comfortably takes the crown as the richest country by GDP on the continent. Mad. In 2016, Germany recorded the highest trade surplus in the world, worth over $300 billion. This economic result made it the biggest capital exporter globally. Germany is one of the largest exporters in the world, with around two trillion dollars worth of goods and services exported in 2019. The automotive industry gross production value in Germany accounts for roughly five. Yeah, well, you gotta think, right? Off the top of my head, I can think of so many, and I, I, I have seen these German videos now, so like, I do know a bit more, ger like, of Germany brands. But like, the cars, bro. Germany just makes cars and cars and cars and cars, man. 100 billion euros in total sales. In 2019, around 3.5 million vehicles were exported, which was around 20%. Wait, of what was that? 100 billion euros in total sales. In 2019, around 3.5 million vehicles were exported. Wow. Which was around 20% of all exported cars in the world. The in Yo, Germany's exporting 20% of all cars in the world. Yo, no wonder they're a European powerhouse, bro. The industry employs around 800,000 people within Germany and oh, accounts wow. for around 10% of the total national GDP. Wow. German cars are known around the world yep. for quality and value. Brands such as BMW, Mercedes, Audi, and Porsche are some of the most prestigious brands in the world. With a revenue of 278 billion US dollars in 2019, Volkswagen is Germany's biggest company. It is the 133rd most valuable brand at a market cap of around 105 billion US dollars. Wow. However, what blows my mind is that a company of this caliber is still 27 times smaller in terms of market cap 
than the most valuable company, Apple, at around $2.7 trillion. Yo, 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 but I'm not gonna lie, Apple's a freak of a company, bro. Yo, Apple is a... <laughs> ...time of making this video. So wow. Germany's GDP makes them the richest country in Europe, but as mentioned earlier, this does not reflect the wealth of its citizens. Let's okay. look at the USSR as an example. It was an extremely wealthy empire, but the everyday citizens who lived in it were very poor. So right. instead, let's take a look at GDP per capita, which is a more accurate way of seeing the true wealth of citizens. For this, Germany ranks 17th in the world and actually 12th in Europe. Okay. So not bad, but certainly not as good as where their total GDP ranks them. Yeah, that's what I was going to say, bro. If you're ranked number one in Europe for GDP, but then number 12 for the citizens and stuff, that's a... Uh... What's going on there, bro? It must be noted, however, that some of the nations that rank above Germany are incredibly small, such oh. as San Marino and Luxembourg, whose populations are 34,000 oh. and 642,000, respectively. So it's not a fair... Well, yeah, that makes sense, then. Germany has the biggest population as well, so, like, you know, I mean, it's got to spread it out a lot more thin. Like, if your country is tiny... Then you got more money, like the more, you know what I mean? more money to give to the man. A comparison for a country who has 84 million. However, these stats do not lie. And although Germany is a financial powerhouse, its citizens on average aren't so much compared to other countries around them. Well, hey, if they're affording Gucci, bro, they're chilling. I can't afford no Gucci. If they're affording, there's a lot of people outside this Gucci store. <laughs> To other countries around them. When it comes to average salaries, Germany ranks 11th in the world and 8th in Europe. Wait, this isn't. Wait, where's UK? Yo. Oh, we're poor. We are poor. Bro, what? At just under 54,000 US dollars or 50,000 euros. Wow. So again, not bad, but not the best. When it comes to enormous wealth, Germany has the fourth highest amount of billionaires in the world at around 134. Only India, China, and the US have more. This Wait, I actually really like these graphs. I ain't gonna lie. I'm sorry I paused it, but like, these are really interesting me. So there's 735 billionaires in America? 539 billionaires in China, 166 in India, 134 in Germany, 83 Russia. Bro, we need a UK stat, man. How many? I'm Googling it. I'm Googling it. Hold on. How many? How many UK billionaires? My guess is 70. Oh. It says 171. Or oh, maybe, maybe there's a lot more. This year. I don't know. Maybe they've all gone up as well. Wait, actually, hold on. Let me, uh... Hold on. How many... Germany billionaires? 136. You gotta buy two. What about America? Um, this is so interesting. 759. Wait, how has the UK got up so much? Yo, who's got rich in UK? <laughs> China and the US have more. This means that there are around 3 billionaires per 2 million people in Germany. Oh, wow, around okay. 3 million, Germany has the fourth most billionaires in the world, only behind Japan, China, and the USA. Wait, that's how many millionaires there is in each country? What? That's how many millionaires there is? Wait, that can't be right. Wait, 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 that can't be right. That can't be right. That can't be right. Bro, the UK has 60 something million people. You're telling me 2.5 million of the people in the UK are millionaires? No, 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 that's not right, bro. There's most billionaires in the world, Germany. At around 3 million, Germany has the fourth most billionaires in the world. Millionaire? No, that can't be right. You're telling me there's 2.5 million millionaires in the UK with a population of 70 million? I swear to you, bro. That don't sound right. How is there that many millionaires, bro? And I'm broke. 
<laughs> bro, what? That don't make sense. But United States, 21 million millionaires. Yeah, I thought being a millionaire was like a rarity, bro. This, these, stats, these stats are making me feel even worse than what I am right now. Man, I gotta get my money up. Only behind Japan, China, and the USA. This is Germany is responsible for over 5% of all millionaires in the world. There is absolutely no doubt that Germany has benefited greatly Mad. from the Euro. By getting into bed with more sluggish economies in Southern Europe, Germany adopted a much weaker currency than would otherwise have been the case. As one of the very few countries in the world running a balance of payments surplus, the Deutschmark would have been a great deal stronger than the Euro. However, this has provided a terrific boost to German exports, which are cheaper to overseas consumers as a result. But right. this goes only some way to explaining Germany's current economic might. Just as important are the relative low levels of private debt. While the rest of Europe gorged on cheap credit throughout the 1990s and uh -huh. 90s, German companies and individuals refuse to spend beyond their means. Oh, In really? German, borrowing is schulden, which is the same word for guilt. There oh, is wow. an attitude that if you have to borrow, there is something wrong with you. This has been particularly <laughs> beneficial to Germany in recent years. Unlike its European counterparts, consumers and businesses did not need to slash spending to cut their debt levels when oh, banks wow. stopped lending during the 2008 crash and recession. Germany is pretty much positioned to become astronomically wealthy. Germany is centrally situated in Europe. I cannot believe how much of a powerhouse Germany actually is. I didn't realize this, bro. Like, I knew there was a big country, but I didn't realize how big. Has access to the sea and has great river connections. Wow. Germany can service markets across Europe from its central location. Germany yep. also has access to both iron and coal, which means it can make steel and generate power without having to import anything. Oh, the no Germans way. Germans have a fairly homogenous culture, barring a lot of immigrants from Turkey in the post-war era. That culture stresses value of hard work, thrift, education, and collective action. A perfect combination for creating successful companies and industries. The Germans came out of World War II with a destroyed infrastructure, but a lot of smart people. With the help of the Marshall Plan... That's what I'm saying, bro. After World War II, man, they've done a lot, bro. They've really gone to work. Because this is, uh, yeah, this is mind-blowing to me. They were able to rebuild the infrastructure, and the smart people worked with great diligence to restore wow. their material wealth. Germany had a pre-war reputation for making high-quality goods, and German companies traded on that reputation in the post-war era, making things like cars, industrial equipment, chemicals, and electronical goods. The German people have had a very stable political system since the war too. When reunification became possible, the West Germans mobilized quickly to make it happen and deployed a lot of money to smooth the transition. There was relatively little objection in German society to the reunification, even though it was quite expensive. So to summarize, Germany is a resource rich, geographically central country with a large population who have- Wait, why does it say 60th most populous country on earth? When I thought it was like top five popular. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, yeah. Huh? Wait, I'm confused. I thought it was top five. You've obviously got India and China, Russia, America. And then Germany, right? No? Why does it say 16th? Geographically central country with a large population who have the right values to be successful and with a political system that is very stable. Thank you for watching and we will see you very soon wow. in the next video. Bro, that's insane, man. Germany's done so much. I didn't realize any of this. Really enjoyed checking out these videos, learning about Germany and stuff like that. So yeah, if you guys got any video suggestions, let me know in the comment section. Also, let me know what you guys think in the comments. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe for more content. I'm live every single day on twitch.tv forward slash L3WG. If you guys want to check me out over there, I'll see you on the next one. Peace.